Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name is Ken and today's experiment is a soap powered boat. As always, adult supervision is required. What you need for this experiment is scissors, paper, water, soap, and a pan. You take your paper boat that you cut out. Um, it could be any kind of shape. Uh, you put it in the water. Then you're going to take uh, your dish soap and place your toothpick just on the tip of it to get a small amount of uh, soap on there. And then you're going to place that right in the middle of the back of the boat. And there it goes. Soap power boat. The movement of the soap power boat has a combination of three principles. All liquids have a little thing scientists like to call surface tension. Water molecules are strongly attracted to each other and stick closely together. This creates a strong but flexible skin which the wa on the water surface, which is able to support small insects or materials such as our little small paper boat. The second principle is Isaac Newton's third law of motion says, for every action there is an equal or opposite reaction. The movement of the soap provides a pushing force backwards into the water surface as the soap molecules spread out, sending the boat forward i.e. equal to the opposite motion. And the third and last uh, principle is the Margoni effect, which is uh, acting upon the boat. This effect describes how the liquid in the high surface tension pulls more strongly on the surrounding liquid than the liquid with the low surface tension. If it changes the surface tension in some parts of the liquid, you introduce a different surface tension. A presence of the surface tension gradient will cause the liquid to flow forward in areas in low surface tension to the high surface tension. Soap molecules reduce the water surface tension behind the boat, causing the water and the boat to move forward. Every time you want to repeat this experiment, you need to replace the water as the surface tension is already broke down. You can try different things like a small boat or a big boat, or do like I'm doing here and just putting the soap on the back part of the boat to see what happens. As you see, I put it down, and it shoots off just as easy as putting the toothpick there. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to like and subscribe, and thanks for watching.